Back. Police Minister Becky Kale says SAPS officials deployed to Westbury in Johannesburg will tackle crime there head on. Kale, who visited the area today on an imbizo, has deployed units, including the tactical response team, to fulfill the mandate to restore calm in the gang ridden area. Thirteen people were shot over four days last week following the killing of an alleged gang kingpin. ENCA's Paul Treaty Jones reports. Next year, you won't be here again. 2018 backgrounds was full. What happened? Why didn't you execute 2018? Why didn't you do it? Now you come after we lost our children. It's a rather but, uh, but too late now. Do we really matter? I'm asking you for a time frame. And I'm asking you to execute your duties with military precision. Emotions ran high during the police in Bezo that included Gauteng Premier Panyaza Lisufi and Police Minister Bikele. Residents say their community has become a haven for high-profile criminals. Westbury has been thrust into the spotlight after a spate of violence erupted in the area, allegedly linked to gangsterism. Now community members are demanding action. Yes, you guys said you're coming and you're coming and you're coming. My question is, I need time frame so I can hold you accountable within this time frame from now until when will we see action. Kele has deployed about nine units, including the tactical response team, canine units and detectives to the area. Kele says he'll await progress reports from the SAPS team to ensure stability is restored. We are increasing our tracking teams. Those tracking teams are teams that follow those criminals that we want. Some of those teams will be coming here to work on those outstanding crimes, both organized murder and the GPVF kind of crime. Kela says they'll update the community soon on progress made to fight crime in this area. Pule Chiti Jones, Westbury in Johannesburg.